How are we doing, folks? Welcome back to the Nightmare Cabin. And I've got an unboxing to do. This just arrived in the post. And you know what it is, because you've read the title, you've seen the little thumbnail, and you clicked on it, so you know what we're looking at. And think of it like this. You've actually seen what I'm about to unbox before I have. Uh, I have now, because you've seen the photo that you clicked on, and I've not even seen it yet, but you have. It's, it's, Mad, isn't it? Anyway, here we are. This is the um, this isn't quite the super duper edition, but this it's the edition I want. So here we go. This is the um, if you've been watching previous videos, J.R. Tolkien. He's working his way through. Well, he's done. We've done the Silmarillion so far, and Lord of the Rings, and now we're looking at the Hobbit. And I've got, I'll tell you what I might do actually. If you do get to the end of this and I haven't wound you up already, give us one of them. And also, just put yes or no if you want me to show you my J.R. Tolkien collection. It's not the biggest. I'm sure there's people that have got cabins like this that are just all J.R. Tolkien. But I think I've got some pretty cool stuff. I think it's, um, I think you'd, uh, you'd like it. So if you, give me a yes in the comments if you'd like me to show you my my collection so anyway here we go the big reveal now first off the lord of the rings i think silmarillion did as well but lord of the rings came in its own box not complaining i'm just it, it was an observation so here we go this is the hobbit um I could, for editions like this, these are classic timeless. This is going on my bookshelf and staying there forever. And it's going to get passed on. Relatives are going to be fighting over it, you know. Do I really need the Observer and the fucking, excuse me French, Sunday Times? I, I know it's a classic. I've just spent God knows how much on this edition of it. I don't need these to tell me how good it is. These, these are meant to be like classic timeless editions. Yeah, I could do without that. Anyway, right. Let's, uh... Right, so... It doesn't matter. I'm just giving off observations here. So this is The Hobbit. This is the new... I can't remember how many anniversary editions it is. What you would get in The Lord of the Rings, though, is that this is the pard back so it would be like that but this would be there'd be a hole in it you know but it's fine that's fine i'm not bothered i'm just it's just an observation i love this effect i think that is really cool there's a slip case lever edition as well i, I like them they are nice but i have I did prefer these and the price range. I think it'd be worth it, but yeah, I, I just preferred these, so I'm happy with these. But um, right, so this is um, illustrated by the author. That's you've, I've, I've another edition. I've got the Hobbit has got that as well, but that's fine. Um, I just wanted this to go with the other two. Really, I've got a little, what's this little map here. Let's have a look inside. Oh, what have we got here? This is also in it. Or another map. Let's take the cover off, actually. Let's, this is what it looks like without the cover. Beautiful. So what have we got in here as well? So we've got a foreword from Christopher Tolkien. Uh, notes on the illustration. Forward to the 50th anniversary edition. Oh look, you, I'm not obviously I'm not going to be able to get all, all of them, but look, this is a list of the illustrations, and that carries on for two more. So I'm going to flick through and show off as many as I can some 
photos of the original text there. I'm really happy with this already. I, I love, I, I mean, I, I will buy edition after edition of any Tolkien book. I think they're all fantastic. I love this author. I love the whole world, like world he created. I love, I think every book's a masterpiece. I think I might have missed something there. That looked good. Let's start again. I'm wondering if there's any. Yeah, look, there's all. It's all sketches of. Which is probably what you're going to get. You're not going to get like the Alan Lee editions. Which are all, you know, which are also fantastic. There's a, a classic book I will buy multiple editions of. I don't mind because I am going to read it again and again. And they're just nice to have. And I think, you know, it's just nice to collect books. You never know what the, uh, the parasites are going to ban next or mess with next. So... Get them while you can, I say, and that goes for films as well. Get get physical editions of your favourite films. Um, oh, this looks nice. Oh, look at that! I don't know. I I did get a book recently that I did show off, and I saw in the comments that. It was basically a rehash of something that had been released previously. I don't know how many of these are new or have been in previous. I'm sure it's a mixture of two. But yeah, this is gorgeous. I, I'm really, I'm happy with what I've paid for. And these videos are for you to have a look if you're unsure. If you've already bought it, then you've already bought it. But if you're a little unsure and was thinking of just seeing what it was all about before you pulled the trigger and press that little order button confirm and pay then there we go uh, oh, more here we haven't got any kind of characters or anything yet have we though have you noticed but there's plenty of them about anyway oh yes look at that the original that was that was on the front cover of the first time the the first time i read the hobbit in primary school I think I was about 10 or 11. And yeah, that was on the front cover. Fantastic. Brilliant. There was another. Come on, give me a good one before I. Oh, yeah, that looks cool. Oh, and Bilbo back in his house there you go right i hope that's uh helpful for you there's the uh the man himself the legend on the back inside cover there and uh yeah i think i like you know i've i've got one where it's like a replica of one of the the original print with a cd like an audio of J.R. Tolkien reading a couple of chapters. I think it's got like an interview on there as well and some other bits and bobs. But yeah, I'm really happy with this. It's gonna sit lovely next to the Lord of the Rings and Silmarillion editions of the same. I don't know if there's more to come, but I'll be getting them and I'll be showing them off. If this is your uh, first video, welcome aboard and um, feel free to go back and uh, check out the other ones if there's any others you're thinking of buying. And yeah, hopefully this has been helpful to you. Thanks for watching. And if you would like me to show off more of my collection, give us a comment below just saying yes, and um, I'll do it for you. So yeah, thank you very much for watching. I hope that's good. I hope that's helpful to you. And see you all soon.